how can you recognize a die break? A working die is used until it is noticed that the die is cracking as a result of the tremendous force needed to stamp the design on the coin. Metal can and does enter such a crack when it appears. This causes a raised area at the point on the coin. Die breaks can appear anywhere on a coin. They cannot be faked since it would be most unlikely that a person would or could add a piece of raised metal to a coin. For purposes of identification, one die break serves a most useful function. It authenticates a grant with star variety of this 1922 U.S. commemorative half dollar. Since the star is incused, it could be punched into the no star variety. The star variety sells for over five times of the no star. Most star varieties have a die break extending out from Grant's chin. This break proves the authenticity of the coin. It was because of a die break on an 1803 one cent obverse die that Howard Newcomb was able to prove that the 1804 restrike actually used a retooled 1803 die. Collecting of coins with die breaks need not be limited to the older, more expensive coins. They are just as likely to appear on modern day coins. For dies are not discarded until they show wear, and this is usually accompanied by a crack or cracks appearing on the die. It is possible to follow the progression of deterioration of a die by, no by noting the lengthening and deepening of the break. All that is needed is a good magnifying glass.